Hello everyone and welcome to another Cubase Minute. In this episode, I'm going to show you how to add effects in Cubase and more specifically, insert effects. Timer, let's get started. So let's say I have this vocal here. I've been working till the morning light. And I want to add an effect, maybe a compressor, maybe an EQ, maybe a reverb. All of this, I would do it with a send effect. There are many ways to do this. You can do this with a mixing console, but a very quick way to do this is hit on this E button right here. And as you can see, we have our inserts here. This is where you can add effects in Cubase. So let me go ahead and add a compressor. There we go, and now maybe I want to add also an EQ. As you can see, I've added two effects and I can add way more with Cubase. So let's see how it sounds. Come dance with me, uh, come dance with me, come dance with Now, if you want to bypass or turn off your effects momentarily, all you need to do is click on this icon right here and then you can turn them on and off. And let's see how it sounds with and without. I've been working till the morning light. I don't know. And if you want to turn all the insert effects on and off altogether, you just click on this button right here. Very handy. I've been so this you can use for synths, you can add choruses, you can add flangers, you can add phasers, you can add reverbs, you can add delays, anything that you want. This is how you can add insert effects in Cubase. If you found this video useful, I would really appreciate it if you left a like down below, if you subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notification icon. Let me know in the comments down below what you'd like me to do next in the next Cubase Minute. See you on the next one, guys. Bye-bye.